Home is where the heart is. For Milton Gardner, Kuliang was always a special place. In 1901, the American came to China with his parents when he was only a month old. He and his family spent every summer in Kuliang for a decade. These twin cedar trees are over a thousand years old, perhaps the oldest in Kuliang. Gardner and his friends used to climb them when they were little. Even decades after returning to the U.S., Gardner's love for China only grew stronger and more robust, just like the trees here in Kuliang. Gardner often reminisced about his innocent days in Kuliang. It was his long cherished dream to return to the place he grew up before he died. So, in his death bed, Kuliang, Kuliang. Gardner murdered on his deathbed, and he told her wife Elizabeth to scatter his ashes into the Pacific Ocean, so he could find a way back to his childhood hometown. Elizabeth Gardner made several trips to China to find a place, but all ended in vain. One day, she was going through her late husband's belongings. That's when she found eleven stamps with the postmark Kuliang on them. This is where the stamps and postmark came from, the Kuliang Post Office. With the help of a Chinese student, Mrs. Gardner finally figured out the place her late husband constantly spoke of. In 1992, Xi Jinping, then secretary of the Fuzhou Municipal Party Committee, learned about the couple's story from a newspaper. He decided to invite Mrs. Gardner on a trip to Kuliang. He told Mrs. Gardner that he was very touched by her husband's deep affection for Kuliang and Fuzhou, and it was only naturally for him to invite her for a homecoming. Gardner's childhood friends were among the welcome team. Guo Maolu was one of them. My grandfather was one of Gardner's childhood friends. We received Mrs. Gardner in 1992. My grandfather was thrilled. So was Mrs. Gardner. She finally fulfilled her husband's last wish. Like the cedar trees in Kuliang, bonds between the Gardners and their Chinese friends continue to flourish. We'd like to pass on the friendship and enhance it from generation to generation, so our descendants can tell Kuliang stories to their children. <laughs>